we all continue to navigate the pandemic, many are still turning to the outside world, seeking an escape from screens and ways to get out into their communities. Author Patrick McGuire is taking that one step further. Next week, he is starting an ambitious journey to walk every neighborhood in Boston. He's going to start at the Wood Island Tea Stop in East Boston, plans to cover about half of the neighborhood, the equivalent of a half marathon, just over 13 miles. He'll then cover the other half at a later date. He told our Brianna Pitts he was partly inspired by the pandemic to get up and get outside to learn more about the city and its iconic neighborhoods and the hidden gems within them. I want to rekindle relationships with everyone that I've promised to to meet up for that that cup of coffee. I'm a tea drinker, but a cup of coffee or a drink or and walking is one of the best ways to reconnect with old friends. And I hope to meet some new friends along the way in the neighborhoods of Boston. It's uh, quite frankly getting me away from the computer and it's a fresh start to create some opportunity and uh, hopefully lose a few pounds along the way too. <laughs> well, where are you starting and then where are you ending and how did you come up with planning the route? So each walk uh, requires more planning than you, you might think. Uh, the first walk is this coming Tuesday, August 16th, leaving Wood Island T Station on the Blue Line in East Boston at 7 a.m. It's going to be more than a half marathon, more than 13.1 miles, and covering half of Eastie from Wood Island to Suffolk Downs. And uh, the second walk will be the other half of Eastie. And then after that, the next neighborhood will be to, to be determined. Says all are welcome to join him as he canvasses every neighborhood. He's expected the whole process to take up to two years and 650 miles. The walks are also raising money for Make-A-Wish Massachusetts and Rhode Island, as well as Stride for Stride. We are wishing the, him the best on his walking journey.